These men are learning a life-saving lesson thanks to this. This walnut represents your prostate. This is what's growing in you when you hit 45. They're taking part in a sometimes tough conversation about the importance of education and awareness when it comes to colon and prostate cancer at the appropriately named Man Up Weekend at St. James AME Church in Newark, New Jersey. More African American men than any other culture worldwide, not just the United States, are inflicted with prostate cancer, die from prostate cancer. More African-American men die from prostate cancer than women die from breast, uterine, and cervix combined. And colon cancer is up there too. That's why Dr. Alexander Salerno thinks it's so important to bring his message of awareness and prevention to members of this strong urban church community as part of his UHIP, or Urban Healthcare Initiative Program, which works to combat the disparity of health care and quality of life in urban areas. He says screening for prostate cancer is recommended at age 45 for African-American males, five years earlier than the average Caucasian male with no risk factors, and age 50 for colon cancer. If you have relatives, first-degree relatives, parents, you know, or brothers or uncles that have had cancer, the likelihood that you're going to get cancer is significant. And then obviously the good old saying, diet, exercise, lifestyle. And the most important message? A lot of men are scared. They got to get past that and just man up. We all know men have their egos and men also think that they can't fear fear, but it's a real motivating factor right now that keeps African-American men out of doctor's offices and out of doing the right thing. It's kind of like, you know, termite damage in your house. You detect it early before it gets from the basement to the attic, you save the house. Same thing with cancer. You detect it early and you save your own house. I'm a proud colorectal cancer survivor, and we're sometimes intimidated or afraid of going to the doctor in anticipation of what he might say. But whatever the news is, get it, because that news and that information can save your life. You know, people are dying from colorectal cancer, and it's totally preventable, but you must educate them first. You engage them in that conversation and they learn it. I was observing the room and they were just engulfed in the conversation. I think that the doctor was very informative, very enlightening, but more than all, he was very welcoming and inviting, so we were very comfortable asking personal questions and I really did enjoy that. Taking away the fear and teaching the importance of manning up when it comes to colon and prostate health. Another way Dr. Salerno and UHIP is working to change lives and quality of life in the urban community. Do 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 do